Hey, what's up? So I just wanted to talk about the uh, Hogwarts Legacy Director's Cut rumor, apparently. When I first saw the post about it, um, it didn't say rumor. So I, I don't remember how where I saw it, but I think it was like a fan account or something. But it said like, you know, Hogwarts Legacy Director's Cut um, coming by, you know, developed by Rocksteady or whatever. And I'm like, I'm, I was like, wait, what? And now it pissed me off because I was like, that doesn't make sense um you know why would you switch developer teams to make a director's cut also it's way too soon for a director's cut the game came out a year ago the game's amazing i haven't beat it yet um i just uh haven't been quite in the mood but i i love it so far i i, I it's such a great game um I have a lot of notes too because I was planning to do a, a review, but by the time I get around to doing a review, it'll it'll be a while. I don't know. I have had been in the mood to go play it again lately, like recently, but I'm not quite there. I'm not quite in the mood, and I still have some other games that I'm more in the mood to finish right now, so I'm playing those instead. Um, but yeah, man, uh, this is a it's a really cool game. It's one of the most special ones I've played. Um, gameplay wise, like the open world and the combat and stuff is very familiar, but I, I just love the world, uh, the world they've created. Uh, it, to me, and I read the Harry Potter books, man. I read them, loved them. I only read them all once, um, but I enjoyed them. I also liked the movies. Uh, my mom and my sister were really disappointed in, uh, in the movies in comparison to the books, um, but I, I loved them. I thought they did a pretty good job. Uh, of course they're missing a lot you know let's like, you know a book would have to be like 50 pages long for you to be able to make a proper movie out of it <laughs> uh, these books are huge right you know um and you know they're long in it anyways um yeah so uh apparently i caught up again this morning because i was thinking about doing this video and i was like i don't know man. i don't have enough information i don't want to I don't want to go be just be mad about it or anything and, I, and then i looked and so, so there was a few more newer articles that came out and they all say rumor and i was like okay um now oftentimes though in this industry whatever rumors do often come true i would say nine out of ten uh if you want to be a little more fair eight you could say eight out of ten but from, from what i've seen in the past decade almost every single rumor has come true almost every single one of them so um that's kind of funny uh it's also kind of horrible because almost every one of them has been bad um, I don't think this one is exactly bad. I do think it's, I don't, I would say unintentionally disrespectful, but I don't, it's just strange to me that they would bring on a different dev team to make a director's cut. Um, it reminds, it actually reminds me of that recent story about um, the Mad Max game. I didn't know, I don't, I still don't even know. I, I meant to go look it up, I just don't care. Um, but there was a story recently about like the director of the Furiosa movie, I think. I guess he worked on the game as well or, or wanted to or, or sent them info and then he didn't like how it came out. He said it, it wasn't what they wanted or whatever. Dude, have if you haven't played the Max Mad, Mad, Mad Max game, it's incredible. It's a tent. It's one of the best games ever made. Um, I, just in my opinion, of course. You know, I don't want to overhype it or anything. Um, <laughs> uh, the, it's very. It, I loved the balance between um, vehicle combat and melee combat it was 50 50 it was extremely well balanced uh, and the world the environment's incredible a uh, story pretty cool uh slow you know but cool um but yeah no the, the game was really good anyways so even that they, they go it wasn't what we what we really wanted of it and the game's amazing so it's just like what <laughs> but anyways yeah so uh, uh the rumor the rumors that i saw actually said something like rock study would be working with avalanche studios who who made this game um and i was like okay that makes a little more sense uh i'm but I, I haven't beaten the game so i don't know uh, what exactly they would want to what what they think was missing story I, so um, so far my mind is blown by it um and i do have issues with it i've had i've i have those written down i don't remember what they are off the top of my head but i do remember there's probably a few things that really bug me but overall i'd, I'd probably still give this game at least a nine out of ten uh pro i would bet on it i don't know for sure yet um, but I can't imagine it disappointing me so much by the time I complete it that I would lower my score to an 8 or a 7, you know, right? Like, <laughs> I don't know. It's possible, though. That is possible. Um, but anyways, um, so I, I hope it's not true in a way. When I saw that they were like, we're going to have Rocksteady do the director's cut, I was like, why, why didn't you just make it a sequel 
you know, or like a related game. Why did you have to call her Hogwarts Legacy Director's Kit? That, that's, I hope it's not true, man. Seriously, I think it's stupid. It just doesn't make any sense. On top of that, with um, how recent this game has come out, they might as well just give it a free patch, you know? Um, if it's like needs some more polish or, well, yeah, or, or, or whatever they want to update, you know? <laughs> This director's cut crap. It's literally it's selling you a patch at full price. That's what that is, man. Dude, oh my gosh. What a load of nonsense. Anyways, yeah, so I, I just whatever. I don't know. I'm curious about it. And I normally wouldn't uh make a video like this. I didn't used to, but I think that's gonna be a new thing for me now. I don't know yet. I don't know. This is new for me. I don't I'm talking about stuff that I don't really care about. I the only reason I'm talking about because I don't talk about I don't I'm not I don't care about that like rumor right like it doesn't I'm just like that's stupid whatever. Um, but I love the game. I love the game, so I'm I'm interested in the you know the topic itself kind of a thing whatever yeah. But that whole thing um, is dumb. I mean, and it's not even because I think they would do a bad job right. Like I I have loved Rocksteady games so far uh, you know so. Um, I wouldn't expect it to be bad or anything. I just don't understand why they would get another developer team for this. Like, it, that is where I'm just like, that doesn't make sense. It just doesn't make sense. This game is amazing. <laughs> Anyways, let me know what you think. I will talk to you later. Bye-bye.